everybody, my name is Drew. I'm Pam. And welcome back to another episode of the Kokomo Post Tries, partnered with Gravity Trampoline Park. Today we've got a little bit of a fancier we episode sure do. today. Um, today we are at the Hobson in beautiful downtown Kokomo. You guys might know the Hobson for being a beautiful uh, event space, wedding space, but today we're gonna be trying out one of their new services that they're doing, and it's a craft cocktail tasting evening mm -hmm. where you and some friends can come and they'll have a beautiful fixed cocktail menu that you can try some cocktails, have some privacy. We're gonna meet up with Allie, learn more details about these private cocktail experiences, and I can't wait, you know? Yeah. I don't know about you, I'm not making craft cocktails at my home every night. Yeah, and this is the second video we, where we've done, you know, some cocktail competition uh, almost, yeah. because after Allie's gonna tell us all about the cocktails they're mm -hmm. making, we're actually gonna try to make some on our own. We and are. What happened last time when, yeah. when I had a cocktail? Yeah. Yeah. Would. Let's meet up with Allie so she can tell us more about these experiences. All right, so we are here with Allie, the bar manager here at the Hobson. Tell us more about these experiences. Okay, so we had been brainstorming ways to get the public into our space for a while. So we came up with the idea of doing these private cocktail tastings. So basically it's groups of four to eight. Um, you and your friends come in, me or one of my bartenders make you some awesome cocktails. I love it. If, if someone's interested in booking one of these nights, how would they reserve their date? Yeah, so you just email hello at the and um, somebody will get back to you really quick with available dates and then you can choose from there and if none of those dates work for you we're pretty flexible with working with people to get them in. Okay. Love that. So let's move over to the bar. Um, Allie's gonna make some of these cocktails and also explain to us how to make one of them and let the competition begin. Right, I'm gonna start uh, by showing you guys how to make the blackberry bourbon sour. That's the first drink that's on our menu for March. So as the name says you're gonna start with the base of bourbon. We're gonna add some blackberry syrup. So you're gonna add lemon juice too for that sour. And then just a little bit of our simple syrup. So our simple syrup, we use the raw turbinado sugar, just equal parts sugar and water. Just that up. Pop it open. And I have a couple blackberries here. So the second drink that we're gonna make today is a cucumber vodka fizz. This one's even easier because you build it right in the glass. You don't need to worry about shaking or anything like that. So we're gonna start with this cucumber vodka. Then we are going to add our simple syrup again, a little bit of lime juice this time. We're going to pack this glass with some ice. And then we are going to top it with some club soda. little cucumber wedge. The last drink that I am gonna show you guys how to make today is called the Turnstone. So we are going to start with the amaretto. We're gonna add some dry curacao, which is like an orange liqueur. We're gonna add that simple syrup again. And then a little lime juice. And then we are gonna strain this wine into a coupe glass. All right, Allie has made the cocktail, so now it's favorite part of our videos. Yes. We get to try everything. So let's try cucumber vodka fizz. Okay. It's beautiful. She wasn't kidding. That's so cute. We have separate straws to yeah. be yeah. safe. Probably there was lime juice there was. in that, Ooh, correct? Yeah. With a I lot like of cucumber lot. taste. That's really good. Ooh, that's really nice. Yeah. All right, next one, let's try the blackberry bourbon sour. Do you like bourbon? Uh, I do. It's not my drink. That, like, this probably wouldn't be the drink that I would order, but it's beautiful, and I can't wait to try it. Gives me old-fashioned vibes, like a sweeter bourbon drink. Definitely taste the Ooh, blackberry okay. in there. I am that's surprised really how much I like that. That's delicious. All right, the next one, the Turnstone, which there's gotta be a story behind this name. I love the name. Yeah, I love that. I love the orange liqueur. I'm imagining this is maybe a sweeter cocktail, but I yes. love the orange and the... That's really good. Ooh, this is really nice. This type of cocktail though. Dangerous. It's dangerous yeah. because it just tastes like a really yummy punch. Mm -hmm. All right, so we've tasted all of them. Well done, all yes. delicious. Allie, what I would like to do is for you to pick which one you want Pam and I to try to read for recreate. I'm gonna have you guys try to make the turnstone. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a challenge. Yeah, that's hey, the challenge have you using the shakers, yeah. a little more ingredients. I love that. All right, so Pam and I, we're gonna try to make the turnstone. Uh, we'll see who's gonna win. 
Gravity Trampoline Park is Indiana's premier indoor trampoline park, but it's also the easiest, most fun way to celebrate a birthday or special event in Kokomo. Let Gravity take care of the setup, cleanup, and all the details, giving you more time to create outrageously fun memories with your kids. Each party features 60 minutes of jump time, a private VIP room, jumping socks for all the jumpers, food, beverages, and more. You can customize a package that's perfect for your group and spend time jumping, bouncing, ziplining, and celebrating. But Gravity isn't just for kids. With the all-new Adventure and Ninja courses, plus the beer, wine, and adult lounge, Gravity makes the perfect spot for a holiday party, family reunion, or other memorable event. They do private rentals as well as several styles of fundraisers for schools and organizations. Spots book up quickly, so don't delay and call today. For more information, visit gravitykokomo.com. All right, so here we go. We're going to make the turnstone that Ali showed us. We have some amaretto, some dry curacao, simple syrup, and some lime juice. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to get started. We got the shaker here with the ice. Let's try to start with the amaretto. I think I've already messed up. I used the wrong end. That's okay. We're going to go ahead and move forward. I'm going to put a little bit more. And then we're gonna know the curacao. Maybe I didn't. Pour that in there. Simple syrup. The lime juice. Here comes the fun part. Put the top. Hit it. Pray to God it doesn't spill. The other side maybe. Aha! And you pour. There is my turnstone. Let's see what Pam can do. Now it's my turn and I paid attention to Allie. Also in full disclosure, I did not leave the room while Drew was making his. I don't know if that wasn't fair. So here we go, amaretto. Okay. Okay, and then smaller amounts of simple syrup. This is where it becomes a real challenge for me. I can pour things, but uh, shaking things in a cocktail mixer. Here we go. Okay, Ali said I should shake till it gets frosty, and my hands are freezing, so I feel like I'm probably done now. Can I pop it off here? Dang it. I think there's a delicious cocktail inside of these cups that I cannot get apart. <laughs> Any advice? I need to phone a friend. <laughs> My cups are stuck. You can do it, Pam. This is not good. There we go, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, another step and I, that I've learned from the last time I made a cocktail on camera, which was with you. This does not go on the glass. It goes on the shaker. <laughs> Darn. I also have more than Allie, but I will not forget my garnish. And there is my Turnstone. All right, so we've made our cocktails. We have them in front of us. It's gonna be a tough job for you, is. but which one would you like to try first? Well, I will try yours okay, first. Okay, go ahead. Mm. It's not bad, honestly. Not bad. Not you hear bad. that? Okay. That's better than bad. <laughs> Cheers. I hope you enjoy. Let's suck it up. Also not bad. Also it's, not bad. It is not. All right, so we, I mean, are we going by taste alone? Is it appearance? Was it, um, I don't know, skill? I think I'll add a little bit of all of it in. Okay, be they honest. Got it, honest, I am gonna be honest, they taste very, very similar. Oh wow. Okay. okay. But so one's better. One maybe is closer to the original recipe. I would say okay. that. I wouldn't ah. say one is better than the other. Okay. One tastes closer to what I would make. Okay. Uh, and that is Pam. Yeah! Oh, I mean, congrats. Thank what what you, was what you. was better? I mean, what was uh, I think ingredient proportion wise, hers is a little closer. We're staying true to the recipe. King Pam hit it a little harder. All hard. right, yay! Oh. Anyway, thank you, Allie, so You're much for having us today. Thank you for watching this episode of the Kokomo Post Tries, partnered with Gravity Trampoline Park. Come try this out. Uh, hello at thehopsandkokomo.com. Email them. See if there's dates available where you can yes. come in and try this. It's a fun little um, experience night in Kokomo. This is one of those things that helps debunk that myth that there's never anything fun going on in Kokomo. It's not just a myth, it's a lie, and we kind of proved that Absolutely. today. Absolutely. So thanks for watching this video. We'll see you next time.